who is your funniest friend? The buddy guaranteed uh, to give you a belly laugh. You. And you. I, I you're my funniest you, friend. I did tell you two jokes during the break. You did. Go on, go on. Um, what do you call a man with dumbbells on his head? Jim. <laughs> oh, no! No! You laughed before! So that's really mean. That's you, really that mean. Was, you, you are such a What do you call a woman with a coin on her head? Penny. <laughs> what do you call uh, a fella uh, with a seagull on his head? Cliff. Cliff. It's a classic. <laughs> Listen, according to a new survey, those mates who make you chuckle are more likely to be from the north than the south. Men in the southeast were, I'm afraid, branded a dour, miserable bunch. <laughs> While we're in the northwest, apparently have the funniest bones. Michelle Morrison has put it to the test. It's grim up north, according to the saying, but people there may actually be having the last laugh. According to a survey, there's a geographical divide when it comes to humour. Northern women, like comedian Sarah Millican, come out on top, with men there, like John Bishop, a close second. But are there really more laughs in Liverpool and less lols in London? We are born to be funny. We are born to laugh. I think southerners are funny to look at, but they ruin it with open mouths. I just believe we've got better banter. We're funnier. No, I can't help you with any jokes. I don't know any. Somebody says, no, to the doctors, and the doctor says I've got some. Two snowmen in a field, one says the other, can you smell carrots? <laughs> <laughs> Why is there no pregnant Barbie? Warning, this broadcast has been paused in the interests of common decency. Uh, knock, knock. Who's there? Orange. Orange who? Orange, you're gonna get the door. Are you proud of yourself for that? No, <laughs> no, I'm fine, that was so bad. Ah, we're joined now <laughs> by the actress, Tina uh, Malone, who was obviously in Shameless. <laughs> Uh, who is from Liverpool, supports the survey, of course, that Northerners are funnier than Southerners, but particularly Northern women, while former apprentice star Thomas Skinner from Essex doesn't agree, claiming that Southerners are a bag of laughs. Even something? after that well, joke? Well, no, I've, I've, listen, you've I've put me on for a losing debate, really, haven't you? Yeah. I've just seen a joke from London and I was terrible. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And everyone I know who's from up north is actually really funny. <laughs> but, listen, don't everyone from down south they're not all miserable. You see, you know, who do you like? Who, which I always think when you think of southern comedians, I only ever think of Michael McIntyre, who is yeah, very you've got funny. Rob and Paul Beckett, Jack White, all there's loads of funny ones, isn't there? Tina. Well, you see, I, you know what? I've got friends from all over and all that stuff, and I've got a lot of friends. And you know, my kind of heroes were the Kathy Burks, the Caroline Quentin, yes. Joe Brands, all southern birds, very funny. But we laugh at ourselves. The southerners don't tend to, particularly in I London. I don't know what. Even though you live closer to Downing Street and the Tories, God knows why you're not laughing, because <laughs> we all are, um, <laughs> that you voted them in. But anyway, but I kind of feel that we tell it as it is. We're very upfront. We're very in your face. It's the Celts. Manx Londoners, Manx and Scousers and Leeds and Nottingham, anything kind of north of the Midlands, we tend to have suffered a lot more because the levelling up didn't work and never will. And um, I kind of feel that we have to fight to be heard. We have to get out there. We have to make our... And women generally, let's face it, the matriarchs, yes. the original... When Liverpool was a rich port 100 years ago, the richest, we had these incredible matriarchs. Women had to fight to be heard. It wasn't the men who had the kind of, you know, the stronghold in families, in these big Irish Catholic families that I came from. So we were... Yeah, naturally but... funnier. I know, but listen, let's not get into all that. I just think people down Tom, south... Tom, you're a lovely lad. I haven't got anything and, to and say, really. I'm just stuck swag. on this one. Tom, you've got a bit of swag and a bit of charm, and you're a lovely lad. But I'm telling you now, Northerners generally are funnier, yep. kinder, yep. sweeter, and I've got th nothing against people in the South. Thomas, you've got Do you know what I mean? But, yeah, but, I, but I can't win this debate. Like, you can. You put on all terrible jokes from all the Londoners, yeah? <laughs> And then, and then you've done the poll up north where everyone's gone, yeah, it's 90%. And then I'm on there going, Bosh, we're funny. Bosh. <laughs> Thomas, 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 stand up and show us your shorts. What's that? Yeah. Look at that. I mean, that... you can't see them. Look. Superb. Yeah. Is, well, is that the joke know, of the day? I think, I think that <laughs> might be the joke of the morning, actually. Do you know um, what it is? We're in your face. We'd laugh at you. We, if it, like, I always remember saying to my dad, Do I look fat in this dress? Getting ready to go to the BAFTAs. And he went, well, yeah, because you're fat. You'd look fat in any dress. We tell it as yes. it is. And all my mates went... <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what I mean? But it's, 
I kind of feel in London, people would go, you just don't They would. That kind if I said that at home, I'd get absolutely destroyed. Really? Oh, God, you wouldn't last I mean, with I me. I would, the way I, I never would. to my husband. The thing is, when you, when you think about the comedy of, say, Peter Kay, it is very rooted in the North, isn't it? Yeah. It's not sort of... It's, it's comedy that comes from Bolton, it comes from Chorley, it comes it's, it's from Kelt's those right places. Yeah, but... So it's where you come Kelt's, from, it does matter in comedy, doesn't it? I yeah. mean, it does inform the comedy. I think it does in terms of... Yeah, but, you know, I've just Thomas, been feel free to, to talk Tom. in this debate. Well, I'm, just, I'm just... I'm just, I'm just been talking to Tom. <laughs> lovely guy. Funny. But we were just talking about a certain minister you just had on. He didn't even know who he was. And uh, I'm yeah, allowed to yeah, see Bobby's I drive, I drive a transit van. In fact, <laughs> transit vans are 58 years old today. It's their birthday. Oh, it's one fact. Oh, happy right. birthday <laughs> to you, man. <laughs> yeah. But listen, I... I, look, I <laughs> I don't even yeah, know what I'm saying is, though, it's weird. rooted in having to get on in life, I think, Northerners. We have to battle against that, being the underdog, and we're really... Can you tell me a funny joke? Pardon? Can you tell me a funny joke? Oh, God, I don't do jokes, love. I just... Yeah, I don't do jokes. I'm funnier asleep than most do you, people. Do you want me to tell you a funny joke? Oh, God, on, then. Make it... Right. Keep it clean. <laughs> Gear's your wrist. Vroom, vroom! What's that? It's a motorist. <laughs> Give us your ear. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> brum brum, what's that? I don't know. It's an engineer. Oh, <laughs> uh, the <laughs> joke oh, was good. <laughs> You've built you see, many Christmas crackers. Funny. They were quite good. Come on, look. Now listen, me why? Fighting for us Londoners and us Southerners. Listen, we are funny. Can I, I mean, if you look at, I mean, even well, you know, funny. a lot of the London. I mean, somebody said this morning on Twitter, <laughs> Jack D and people like that. They are hysterical. Yeah. Lee Evans, Jack D. I mean, there's no getting away from it. I don't think it's necessarily something that you have to be from the north to be funny. I just think it's something that's inherent yes. in us. It's almost taking in the our mickey. DNA. Take we take taking the mickey is a very strong yeah, thing. Say something yeah. We take the mickey out of each other. Tina, last and week. We, we go along let, let, with it. Let Tom up. I was going to say, last week I was sitting in my front room, just chilling out, and a book fell on my head. I only had my shelf to blame. Oh, uh, you see, he's coming out strong towards the end of the yeah. year. What I like I've, about you, you're though, racing up. What I like about you is that you're willing to laugh very easily. And I think being able to laugh very easily is a great way to I've got a stay laugh. sane I live in, in the life. South. We're all down and miserable. Oh, We're not funny. Come up team. north. Come and have a come pint in Liverpool. Do you know what? The beers are cheaper up north. The beers, uh, the beers are cheaper. Everything's cheaper. <laughs> Fish and chips, the lot. Not now. Uh, now, we've been asking you on Twitter who do you think is funny, it's Northerners or Southerners? 77% say Northerners and 23% yes. say Southerners. Yeah but, that was before Tom, yeah, but that was before Thomas told his jokes. See, now that it's 90-10. I might be swinging it back. <laughs> right.